good morning or uh, good afternoon good afternoon good afternoon um, I'm in my kitchen I just wanted to show you got a lot of kind of kind of kind of kind of stuff um, I woke up quite early this morning this is the beginning of a new vlog mind you so uh, this is the beginning of another vlog good afternoon it is a uh, 10 to 2 I am wearing a sweater. It, it is a different day, I swear to you guys. It's just that it's cold in Johannesburg right now. It's been raining all morning. And right now it isn't raining, but it's windy and cloudy. So, get banda. Get banda. But uh, my father woke me up this morning. He's got a tendency come December time where he uh, uh, buys uh, things for the house in bulk um, so that it lasts like give or take two three months into the new year so he called me this morning as like listen i've got some things come come pick up some things so that's exactly what i did and i'm going to show you it's mostly cleaning stuff because um everything else i mean i can i can afford i can afford the stuff but then he's buying it in bulk and he was like my child my dearest child i probably you know i know that you are broke so come <laughs> come and get some things so i'm gonna show you what i picked up and he also bought me some flowers which is my father my father uh which is wonderful because he knows that i love me some flowers and plants and stuff so i'm gonna show you guys what i got so i can show you the things that i use to clean what i clean with when i'm home uh, and there's also some food bits as well. So it's not really a grocery. It's like a more like detergent cleaning stuff kind of hole. <laughs> but not like a groceries, like food kind of thing. So let me show you what I got. So this is pretty much what I picked up from my old man. So kind enough, kind enough. Um, got these Harpic um, Flushmatic toilet cleaners so you just literally throw this into the you know the, the the toilet at the top not at the bottom right um and it just turns the water green and cleans keeps the toilet clean and all of that um a huge detail because for bathing this is for bathing so this 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 is good for the days where i feel like clean extra clean I use this and then uh, for my floors this is my favorite 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 um, uh, Cobra tile cleaner and this is in the uh, apple scent crisp apple with essential oils okay this is a new one with essential oils really okay this is a new one I don't know normally I just pick up the crisp apple but yeah uh, sunlight because of course this is probably gonna last me three or four months because it's a lot key it's a lot. And then this would probably last maybe six months because there's a jeke, 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 jeke. It's a lot of jeke. Uh, but bleach is very important in my home because, uh, yes, you got to get rid of, right, eating yam. <laughs> and I also got some handy andy. Uh, this is the handy andy ammonia fresh. Oh my God, we didn't even get like a scented one. Okay, anyway. Handy Andy uh, cleaner cleans everything pretty much in the house. Uh, got these as well. I picked these up. He was like, he was like, do you do you need any? I was just like, yeah, man, okay, I'll get this. I'm really really enjoying the Nivea deodorants that come like this. Normally I use the Pearls and Beauty one, which is like a roll on kind of thing, but recently i started using the pearls and beauty this version of the deodorant and i'm really really enjoying them so this time around i picked up fresh musk and fresh natural and then um to wash my body i got the um, what is this the dove renewing uh shower gel and then the other one is sensitive micellar this one there's too many things here sensitive micellar water and in the back here we've got the sunlight um getting to a fabric conditioner like baby soft yeah one but fabric conditioner and then my favorite toothpaste i feel like i've spoken about this toothpaste on my channel before uh my dentist recommended this toothpaste and if you are somebody who's got very sensitive teeth like i do this changed my teeth game for like 
sometimes change my tooth game i literally like hot things cold things my teeth don't give me a fuss ever since using this and i've probably used this for about two years now really really good um these you have seen me use in my home especially in my uh clean with me video you've seen me use these these are the Dettol uh kitchen cleaner I use this to, to, to clean my kitchen. They smell amazing. My favorite one being that one. The lemon zest uh, scent. I almost said flavor. <laughs> and then Mr. Mini because the house needs to smell nice for wooden surfaces. Well, they call it a multi-surface cleaner. But, you know, for me, I really use it for uh, wooden surfaces. And then Domestas, which I normally use for, you know, my toilet. Um, my toilet. <laughs> And then we've got the Dove Beauty Cream Bar, which comes in fours. So, and then the Garby garbage bags. These are the really, really good ones. These are the strong ones. They are for uh, garden refuge, refuse, but these are the good ones. Before I show you the flowers, toilet paper. And it's just like, pick up some toilet paper. You might need it. We're in the middle of a pandemic. And I'm just like, okay, but this is not America, but okay. Okay, and then uh, got a diffuser. I saw this at uh, Woolies, and I thought, okay, I haven't seen Woolies diffusers before. It's the first time I, I saw it, and it was relatively cheap, so I picked this up because I wanted to try it out. So we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. And then we got All Brand Flakes, and again, Woolies Oat and ancient grain flakes. I don't know. I don't know. I did. Kind of weird. Um, then I picked these up for dinner today. Because I really don't feel like cooking. It is Saturday. Okay. And then, of course, Lipton green tea. Because, yeah. Yeah. Because. And then lastly, sunlight auto machine washing powder. Auto is from chin. Yeah, but in auto is from chin. And then for hand wash, iti hand wash. Yeah, but yeah, but <laughs> all right. Let me pack the stuff away. Is it's a lot of stuff. I need to pack it away. And then I'll touch base with you guys. Oh, 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 oh. Let me show you the babies. The babies. Look at the babies. The babies. They're so pretty. They're so pretty. So we're in my bathroom right now. I wanted to show you. So the one that I'm currently using of this range is this one, which is the Pearl and Beauty one. This is my favorite one. I feel like this this stuff is amazing. I normally use the roll-on, but for some reason the other day I picked this up and I've really been enjoying it. So this one is empty. I recently opened this one this morning and picked these new two up. So glad about that. I'm just going to pack this stuff away because, hello. And for my skincare, I feel like, I feel like I've spoken about the things that I use for my skincare quite a bit, but I need to give props to this eye cream. This stuff is really good. And I feel like my eyes are just like... They're really, really happy, especially under here. The dark marks are pretty much fading, man. Like, I'm looking younger and younger by the day. Uh, and I picked this up from Diskim. This is the Nutri Woman Dermaceutics Eye Lift Gel. Um, let me see. Yeah. So, so, so good. I feel like my, my, my under eye skin has been thanking me for this one. And if you're looking for a new eye cream, try it out. It's about 500 Rand. But it's good. This should last you. I've had it for over a month and a half now. So this should actually last you maybe four months, five months. Really, really good. So not trying to yeah now. And then I remember in one of my videos last, I was asked, what are you spraying on your face? It was a, I don't know, it was a vlog, I think. And somebody asked me, what are you spraying on my face? just after I washed my face in the morning. And this is what I use. I love, love this spray um, without makeup on a lot of the time. This is the Clinique Moisture Surge Face Spray. That's pretty no. much it. That's pretty much it. Um, yeah, my skin has never been more happy than it is now. So 
I feel like I'm doing something right. Right. So I'm getting a little bit personal here. <laughs> this is my linen cupboard. So this is where all my linen goes. Um, mats for the bathroom. Whatever. But I just wanted to show you um, the setup of how I've placed all these extra things. I've put them right at the bottom of my linen cupboard. And uh, same with the soaps, some tissues, obviously the extra ones are here, but um, I removed the, the other packet and I placed them there. And then just further down in there, you have all the, the Domestos, the Dettol, the sunlight, all of that stuff, because I cannot put extra things in the kitchen downstairs. I'll explain to you why I, will, I, I refuse to do that. But yeah, as you can tell, maybe you can see my color palette for my linen. It's always white and a mint green. As you can see, this is like a, a different <laughs> uh, design. And then you've got this, which is a different design. But the color palette is always white linen or mint green. And that's how I roll. Okay. okay. So this is what I wanted to show you. I'm getting real personal with you guys right now. This is the cupboard where it's just below my sink, as you can see. This is the cupboard where the current stuff that is being used sits. So that's the current jig. There's like two more other jigs there and stuff. Um, so I didn't want to put, I could have made space and put them at the back, but I didn't want to do that. And the reason is normally the aunties that clean um, uh, our houses and make them spick and span and whatever. I've noticed that when they can see that there's bulk product, extra product, they tend to overuse the product that's already there because then they know that, ah, well, there's three other sunlights or there's three other chicks and whatever. So if they see it, if they see them sitting at the back there in a row and whatever, they tend to just use too much of a product because they know that there's abundance, which is a problem for me. That's why I went and I put that the, the other ones upstairs so that she doesn't have to see them. She may know that they're up there, but she can just see what she needs to see. And there's even extras here at the back. I can see some Dettol and extra chick and, you know, there's a chick here and then there's a chick in there as well. And then there's another chick in there. So there's a lot going on. Hours who came to say hi the other day with his girlfriend they bought us an orchid this is about a month ago I think and oh my god she is growing so beautifully she looks so nice I need to actually water her I haven't watered her this week so yeah I refrained from putting the flowers over there which is normally where I put the flowers um, I kind of thought nah, to be too much because the plant is already there so because my fruit basket I normally put my fruit basket here, but I mentioned the other day in one of my vlogs that um, I put the fruit basket in the fridge now because it is summertime and there's flies and all of that and <laughs> then I'm not about that life. So I decided to put it here. I feel like it looks nice, makes the kitchen look beautiful. I need to finish off uh, putting the stuff away. My kitchen is kind of looking like a mess. Like I'm just seeing things everywhere. Um, also bought batteries because as you can see, I've got a lot of Christmas lights all over this house that require batteries. And so that's my favorite. very nasty habit of washing my dishes and then uh, as soon as they dry I'll take them off of the drying thing over there and then I'll put them right beside it so these will be dishes that I've had for the past two or three days I'm just too lazy to put them back in the cupboards I find that whole task very tedious but today some of these have been sitting here for like two days three days so today we're putting them back in this is ridiculous it's so tiny look at how tiny it is it's 
so tiny. This is not even going to last a month. But it's not even about that. For me, I think it's, I just want to, the intensity, the intensity. Okay, what I'm about to do, don't do at home, please. Do not do that at home. Do not. All right. It's cute, though. I like the whole black vibe. It's cute. All right, so we're going to test this out for some time and see. I just want to know how strong it will be. Will I be able to smell it? I'm going to put it in the lounge, which is normally where I am every single day. So I want to be able to tell if I can um, smell it or not. So, yeah, where am I going to put it? Hmm. So this one is the one that I moved from the lounge. It's pretty much almost finished. I think I should switch these around. So I'm gonna put this one in the kitchen, just up here. And yeah, so that when it's done, I know it's done and I can throw it out. Okay. smells good I'm smelling sweet things nice things I'm smelling flowers I'm smelling diffusers I'm smelling clean and I love that this is how I want this house to smell my couch on the other hand <laughs> is a tip because I was sleeping on it yesterday and I left it exactly how it was with the blanket there and the cushions all everywhere and it's fine because chances are I'm gonna park right on that couch yet again today and um, edit. So, might as well just leave it like that, you know what I'm saying? In the meantime, I just moisturize my hands. This is another hand cream that I really, really like from Woolies. I'm a fan. I really, really like this hand cream. It's really good. What? What? I got hand cream all over my back. That's good. Moisturizes, smells amazing. It's good. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. All right. I know you guys want content, so I have to sit down and edit now. So there'll be nothing fun about this vlog, really, aside from what I've just showed you. Is that even fun? I don't know. Um, my good friend Palisa, you know who Palisa is, she recommended these to me some time ago she likes gum she's always got gum in the house she's always got gum and floss she's always got gum and floss in her house in her bags she's weird um but she recommended the orbit professional white gum and i was like okay well, i guess i guess and then i tried it <laughs> and it was good i don't really like gum because I've got jaw problems, so I can literally, excuse me, so I can literally chew gum for all of two minutes, then I have to throw it out, because then my jaw gets tired, or it starts, yeah, I've got a, it's a dental term, you can, you can, you can Google it, it's called TMJ, I struggle with that, so, kind of struggle with everything, really, <laughs> Um, but the sun is coming out. That's nice. The house is looking a lot brighter. That's great. I might go out later. Then again, I might not. Let me go. I'll touch base with you guys a little bit later. The book that I'm reading, I'm about 30 pages away from finishing it. Oh my God. It's, it's getting sad. It's getting really, really sad. Mm. I must water my orchid. <laughs> There we go. It's getting really sad, but um, 
It's a good book. All right, let me, let me work. Let me do some work. Talk to you guys later.